Hi Shrika. Hi. So I know Victor Axelson is uh, is a bit ahead in ranking points, but you're hot on his heels. So world number two, Kidambi Srikant. Are you getting used to it? It's just been one day. I'm really trying get trying to get used to it, but uh, but yeah, I know it's it's like it doesn't really matter that much. You know, it's more about winning tournaments. Still, I mean, did you try it? Like like who was the first one to say world number two, Kidambi Srikant? Did you read in the papers? How was it? <laughs> Like, uh, I know I was at the academy when the rankings got updated, so I know there are the people at the academy told me that. Shikam, very few people know that you initially started off as a doubles player with your brother Nand Gopal. How did this uh, shift to singles happen? Is there like a story behind it? Uh, not a big story, but uh, you know, until my juniors I used to play all three events. And then after the juniors is, is when you know, Gopi sir actually wanted me to play only singles. And then you know, it's his decision to actually changed me and I think it, it did really work well. And, and surely your experience as a doubles player has helped your singles game as well? You know, I, I never felt it that way but uh, you know, many people told me that so I think, I think yes. But you're not sort of conscious of you know, there are yeah. some things that you did. Like when, you, when, you, when you're playing a match, you don't really think too much about you know, all these things. Uh, you know Shikant, I interviewed uh, Mr. Padukone last month. And uh, he said, you know, there was a time when uh, Indian players would look at the draw in a tournament and they would see like they're coming up against the Chinese early on, they'd be like saying, okay, I'm back, back up. Now he says, it's the opposite is almost true, you know, Chinese players look at the draw in a tournament and then they see they're up against Indian players and then they're like, oh, this is going to be tough. Do you agree? Uh, I think, yeah, I think uh, we've been playing really well in the last, uh, say, I think 12 months or something, you know. Uh, all the men's singles players have, have been doing really great. Uh, it, I think uh, it's really important for us to be more consistent from here. And I think uh, if we can really be consistent uh, and play well, I think definitely it'll definitely happen. Now, and I know that your uh, your quarterfinal loss in the, at the Rio Olympics to Lindan must have impacted you. But since then, you've had this excellent run of form. So have you gotten over it? Uh, both both of these are different. I think these wins are important, and also you know that Rio Olympic quarter final was kind of a life changing match. I felt uh, you know a, a point on the crucial uh, stages would have made a lot of difference. You know I would have been in another level if I would have won those won that match. So it will definitely remain that way forever. You know I don't think anything can change it. It's a regret. No, I don't really have any regrets, you know, it's like I really played with my best, you know, I don't really have any regrets. Okay, uh, you've been quoted as saying in the press conference that the era of Lin Dan and sort of Lee Chong Wei's domination is over. That was quite the statement, huh? <laughs> I haven't told it that way, I was, I just told that, you know, headline. yeah, you know, I've read about <laughs> it, but uh, it was uh, more about that, you know, we've, uh, I said that, you know, the, you know, the, it's become more open, I think, and, uh, you know, players like Victor, Sean Vano, and then many others who've been doing really well and who were, you know, who could beat all those Linda and Lee Chong Wei, Chen Long, you know, who, who are able to beat all of them, uh, you know, continuously in tournaments. If you actually see Victor, you know, Victor beat Chen Long in semis and Linda in finals, and then Pranoy beat Lee Chong Wei continuously, you know, right. so a couple of times. So I think it's a big thing, and I think I, I only said that, you know, it's become more open. But uh, but yeah, it's always good to have you know a competition that way where you have many champions. You know, it's like you know, it's 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 always good for the sport. Do you have like a best buddy on the circuit or something? Perhaps not Indian players, but like Victor Axelson and you. Like, what sort of a relationship do you share? Uh, like yeah, you know, we do talk. You know, it's a good healthy relation. You know, every time we got get on court, you know, we really want to win. But otherwise, you know, we are very friendly. So, uh, Shrikant, your brother has been quoted as saying that the only time you've sort of taken some sort of relaxation from your training has been when you went to watch Bahubali 1 and 2. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, you know, I really took a session off, you know, the morning session off. So, you know, we went there. First day, first first day show? morning show, yeah. Ah. <laughs> so, we took the morning session off and went for the movie. Okay. So, you're a Bahubali fan? You know, but I really love uh, Rajmoli sir. So I think all his movies were fantastic. So I really took that, you know, session off. Do you know that you look like Dhanush? Like a lot of lot of women <laughs> in my office say that you, you, you look. No. And if there's a biopic made on you, Dhanush should play you. Oh, nobody no. told me this before. No, <laughs> no. <okay. laughs> all right, there's a first then. Do you like him though? 
Yeah, yeah. I watch his movies. Yeah. Do, right? <laughs> okay. All right. Uh, so uh, I'm going to do a quick rapid fire. Okay, Shikhar. Yeah. Guntur or Hyderabad? Guntur. Bahubali one or two? Two. Uh, your childhood idol in badminton? Gopi sir. Your sporting hero, non badminton? Roger Federer, Mahendra Singh Dhoni. Okay. Favorite actress? Not really, yar. I watch movies because Chani, you know, I yaar, come on, seriously. One. No, anything, Telugu, Hindi, English. Anything, yeah. I really love watching movies. That's it. Okay, yeah. tell me three. <laughs> no, it's like not like that. You know, it's okay. like I'll let say you Anushka. I, I really like Anushka in Bahubali. In okay, okay, okay. And uh, finally, one. Tell us your favorite. You watch movies. Which one I'm asking you? This your favorite oh. Telugu film that now. Oh. <laughs> you can think about it. Yeah, I don't know. I can't really say. You know, I'm not you. someone who who really want to act. I'm someone who really want to direct. You want to direct, huh? Yes. Are you serious? You want to do film? Yes. I love movie making. And have you sort of experimented with no, anything? No, no. The... Like I'm busy with my own life, and you know? I didn't really get time to do it. And Mr. Rajamouli is like somebody you look up to, which is why because of yeah. film making genius. <laughs> yeah. So Shrikant could be a director of films in the future. Who knows? Who knows? Who okay. knows what life has? <laughs> I know. Thank you for speaking to yeah. scrolls. Thank, Thank you. you.